Hello everyone, welcome to Kid Hat Model Club. This is a game by Floating Origin Interactive that is currently in early access, just released into early access. And it is from the creator of Kerbal Space Program, Harvester, but it is obviously of a different sort. Uh, originally it was the Balsa model flying, something like that, Balsa. I had the Balsa one, I got this Kid Hack Model Club because I had the Balsa one. So I tried the Balsa one and frankly, I like going fast. <laughs> I, I like flying things, of course, uh, but I like going fast. That's a very important thing. And so I'm not entirely sure that this is a game for me because I don't think any of these planes are going to break the sound barrier, but we'll see. Uh, so basically that's what it comes down to. As far as settings, it's uh, very nice actually. Um, we've got, well, especially as far as inputs are concerned, I managed to input I get all the inputs I need. I've got my flight quadrant there. I've got the yaw axis. There's some weird audio artifacting though going on in the background. Now this was, I think, the same as the previous game where it had very thorough stuff. But you can hear the bursts of audio uh, going on in the background. I don't know why that is. But anyway, uh, yeah. So if you need to repair things, uh, let's say this reverse thrust is unassigned, you click the, that, you pick your device and you select that, or if you just want to um, use increase access, it's got very thorough control stuff. Uh, I've changed some of these things to joystick buttons and I haven't done much with uh, like the editor stuff, so I hope that's okay. but. Uh, I've got the weapon groups on my joystick buttons as well. Very important, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what we're going to be shooting, but... Okay. So, uh, that is the situation, and apparently there's a section for mods, but who knows. Who knows. Uh, I don't recall changing anything, so discard changes. Okay, back. Yeah, there's some bursts going on. Let's just start the game and hope they go away. Okay. Um, yeah, let's go. Let's see the intro. So again, early access, but it did have the balsa phase where it was also early access, so I don't know. I hope it's in the decent, uh, uh, you know, it's improved since then. Okay, there's, <clears throat> there's my plane. This is familiar with the controller and all. Press A to pick it up. Okay, see, now there's a problem. I don't actually have an A. I didn't want keyboard and mouse only, which is another controller option you get when you start the game. But... Okay, it's actually left click. Left click is what I need to do. Okay. Hold shift to increase throw force. I thought we had a bar for that. And press A to let go. Okay, uh, shift did not increase throw force. Hold on. Uh... How do I get rid of the screen? Okay, well I've got my throttle, so maybe I should just use the throttle for the for the throw force instead of shift. Okay, well, okay, uh, yeah, yeah, using the throttle instead of shift works. But I think it's confused now. Oh, we can click this for retrieve vehicle. Okay. Okay, so should we pick it up? Hmm. No, we've got roll trim and pitch trim. That's nice. Uh, but... Yeah. I need some better guidance for what I should do. I can leave the plane where it is, so that's okay. Okay, left click is A. <laughs> uh, this is the vehicle editor. This is where you can design and build and modify vehicles of all shapes and sizes. Maybe I should just remove all the key bindings associated with gamepad though. I do have an Xbox controller if I wanted to use it. Doesn't look like the worst balance plane to be honest. I wouldn't be able to tell just by looking at it. Make the nose longer. I mean, because we don't know how heavy the nose bits are. Move to the part list and drop it there. New fuselage. New nose. 
Okay, if you say so. Wasn't doing that badly. Okay, shift. Okay, shift is working now, and throttle wasn't doing. Oh wait, throttle seems to be doing something. Maybe it was just taking too long. Oh, it hopped again. I mean, I maintain it's doing pretty good considering it doesn't have an engine. Control surfaces, yeah, well, that'd be good. As indicated. Is that as indicated? Uh, oh, wait. No, that's not right. No, it doesn't look good. Okay, no. Hold on a sec. These, the, they, they, they're not looking good. Please let me fix them. <laughs> Please. Uh. Why, why can't it let me fix them? It's too controlling. This tutorial. It needs to let me mess around a little bit more. Whatever. Fine. They look horrible. That's how it's gonna be. Okay. It doesn't give me the throw force indicator with my throttle yet. Okay, now with the, that... I got that little handle. Okay, that's fine. Right now that's just tilting the plane when I use my joystick. So, I don't know if it's using the control inputs at all. I don't see the elevators turning. Or the, the rudder seems to turn. I don't see any movement from the elevators when I do pitch. It just turns the plane. Okay, uh, lower the transmitter. Fine. Move around. Take my plane to the marked area. Oh. I can run. Okay. I guess we're running through here. I mean, going through here. Okay, I've throttled up. And it's not with shift. It doesn't show me my angle, of my throwing angle right now. Oh, I can control it. Uh, I can't control roll though. Well, I did 10 seconds. I didn't keep it on the runway though. Okay, that's what they wanted. Okay, that's that. Take on scenarios and missions using the challenge boards around the world. Challenge board. Let me take the plane. Look at leaving your junk lying around. Okay, basics aircraft controls, basics car controls. I don't think I need that. Now, to the end of the course in as few throws as possible, glider golf, no gas or electricity. Okay, um, that sounds like a plan. Let me just get it looking right. Well, I guess shift and Q, A, and D works like that. That's fine. Just wish it would tell me. So shift E and Q rotates like that. So that's Kerbalish. I want a rotation gizmo. There there there's a rotation, right? Rotate. Okay. Angle snap off. Okay, that's fine for ailerons. We already had a rudder. They gave us that automatically. Okay, roll it seems to be doing, and presumably it knows what it's doing. Pitch is there. And no, you don't need to do roll. I hope. So, um, where's that interesting aerodynamic overlay? Graphical representation of how your aircraft is expected to behave in flight. 
naturally pull itself straight again. Amber is bad. Seems fine, I guess? Well, we can't go. Center mass is pretty far back compared to where I thought it would be. Okay, well now we can go. Let's try this golf thing. But it doesn't tell me... I, I, is there no money? Few throws as possible. Use rockets to give your glider an extra... Hey, I thought it was no engines, but I guess it said no gas or electricity. Too far from the throw area. Well, yeah. Travel there to begin playing. M for map, but we need to get to... Come on, a golf course should be like really obvious on this map because <laughs> they take a lot of land manly park huh? oh there twin bay I guess vehicle does not meet mission requirements what do you mean Yes, so there was no risk. Okay, end mission. I I okay. It took a while to end mission. Okay, hold on a sec. Allowed, but you can only fire them once. There's a glider requirement. No gas or electricity. Didn't require the rockets. What I've got is certainly a glider. Wow, that's that hole is pretty far away. It's an extraordinary hole. Okay. Oh, uh, 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 oh, I stalled. I stalled. Uh, don't get hurt. Safety first. Okay. What? Well, why is it like that? Okay, adding this part will- so it shows disqualifying parts. Too many battery parts. Oh, we have a battery part in there? Maybe the cabin is a battery- oh, which one is a battery part? Did it sneak- is that a battery in there somewhere? I think there's one there. Aha! How dare you sneak a battery like that? But how's the balance gonna be? I don't think the, C the COM changed that much. Still seems the same. Okay, now we don't have a battery. Maybe that'll make it fly even better. Okay, so that was the problem, I think. We had, but without a battery, we can't control it. It's just a pure glider, right? There's really no point in having the control surfaces then right uh, apparently I can't move windows around so this glider golf over overlapping this glider golf thing I can't change that I can't move these oh well I don't know why it's got this weird red thing majiggy on it maybe that means it's the plane that's being tracked by the then it stops here, though. So I don't know. Oh, I can still control it, but its wings ripped off and everything fell apart. Oh, and now I have a head. Um, okay, uh, because I didn't put a rocket motor on. It was like it had a rocket motor or something. Okay. Weird things are weird. This time it wasn't all crazy. Maybe it was damaged before. Okay. I swear the trees changed from last time. Okay, I'm trying for gentle-ish landings. Okay, throw from here.
Ow. Okay. Six holes, huh? Okay, uh, not in the tree, not in the tree. Oh, the tree isn't collidable, I think, don't think. Ooh, that's not a bit great place, though. Uh, ooh, ow. Six throws so far. Maybe I should have put rockets. Okay, there's a big old sand pit, or whatever you want to call it there. Maybe I should have a little bit more angle. But I'm afraid of it stalling. Oh, that's... Uh-oh. Pit! Pit! No, this way, this way, this way. Oh, it broke. Okay, but it healed. <laughs> okay. I wonder how we're controlling it without the battery. I guess the battery is only for if we have an electric powered plane. It doesn't matter for control. Okay, well, pitching up is a lot better. But we have to get really close. That's not close enough? Oh, come on. Okay, start next hole. Oh, throw from here is over there. I didn't see that before. Okay, throw from here. All right. Okay. Not too sure about the reward for this though. Okay, that was a bad move. Oop. Oh, that was an invalid throw. Oops. Oh, oh, no, but don't kill the plane. Don't kill the plane. Okay. Throw from there. Oh, wait, but... But it took this position. I don't understand. It still says invalid throw. But it counted it as a throw. And it said throw from there. So I don't understand. It still says throw from there. It's always the putts that are the problem. I <laughs> know. Uh, anyway, um, this time it didn't say invalid throw. Okay, they auto heal anyway, so. Okay, well, seven throws. Start next throw then. It says I completed that. Okay, throw from here. And we're going up there. Well, I should have known it was going to get trickier. But that's a short distance. It's just high altitude. And complicated. Okay, best bet is probably this direction. Okay. Um, throw from here is fine. Uh, we'll have to hang a left. Maybe 
Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, don't slide. Don't. Oh, it's sliding. It's sliding. Great. Fine. Yeah, sneak as much. Okay, there. I'll take that area. That's fine. This is real steep, though. Ah, uh, okay, the trees are collidable. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. No! Great. At least they auto heal. Yeah, it auto heals, but. Okay. Maybe this will be better. Okay, okay. Pitch down. Don't slide, don't slide. No! No! Come on, that's cheating. There's some friction, right? Ah, oh, no wonder they made this short. Okay, at least it's starting from there. There's a little green patch here. It's not a green patch, you'll slide. Okay, where where is the marker even? There. Okay, we're on the green, folks. We're on the green. What nasty business do they have for the next few holes? That counts, right? Okay, thank you. Thank goodness. Alright. Okay, too far from throw area. Throw area, where are you? There you are. And we are going there. Fine. I can't see what that actually entails, but... Go over here, not a bush. Okay, well, that's probably enough clearance. Oh, cars. I wonder if they can run me over. Probably not, but it'd be funny. Okay. We're descending. Should get good range like that. But there's trees. Oh. Ah, I have limited control here. Ah. Okay. Um, this is where a rocket engine would be good, but I think we can do this. There's a lot of trees here. This is not the best location to use. Ouch. I mean, best approach to use, probably. Okay, try to get clear here. That's too far. All right, here we'll do. Want. Oh, I, I don't know if I can get clear of the trees. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay. Okay, you can do it. Ah, oh, you gotta fall short of it. Hop a little bit. Ah, oh, hop a little bit. Oh, well. I tried my best there. 200 meters. Okay. Sometimes I collide into the trees. Sometimes I don't. These are weird trees, too. Hardly worth a throw. <laughs> Come on, that counts, right? Ah, oh, it didn't count. Oh. Okay. Okay, it wants me to throw from here. I don't know if this has got to be any fun watching this. But, okay, uh, let me, before I throw, 
I'm afraid of what's what's going on here. Yeah, as I suspected, it's water. There's this little strip of land in between, though. I think what we want to do is go up the beach a bit before trying to cross, maybe. Or maybe we should try and cross immediately, I don't know. This is probably a bad idea. Oh well. Okay, well, uh, yeah, up the coast a little bit. Change that plan. Alright. Not as much distance as I would like, but maybe the better idea. Oh no! Why do I have so little energy? No, come on! Uh, barely got there. I thought we would get better. Okay. Um, so like... I died. No! I need to quick travel to that vehicle. Fine, I'll quick travel to lower uptown. Is there a swim mode? I mean... Uh, maybe there's a boat. Or maybe I can swim if I didn't jump from so high. Okay, um... There's no actual saving. So... Okay, well... I hit a wall here. So I'm guessing I can't do that. Oh, wait, no, but then I went in and died. Mm. Let's get, maybe there's a boat. Maybe I have to build a boat. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'll go back to Lower Uptown and see. Hey, do you have a boat? No indication of a boat on this side. Now, map-wise, as far as trying to get that hole done, we pretty much do have to land in this, this spot at the very least in order to cross. So, they've got to have figured out a way to get to it. This just... I mean, maybe if we had used a rocket, but still we'd have to get over to that island. How do we get to that island, right? It's not the same landmass. I can't swim. I can't actually ride the planes. Feel like I'm missing something here. Well, this ap episode has uh, probably gone on long enough. Uh, why don't you guys give me your thoughts about how I should approach this? What are we supposed to do about our plane sitting over there? That is the question. I could. I don't want to start over because <laughs> uh, now that it's there. We can't put a rocket engine on it now, right? So that ship has sailed or plane has flown. Um, so yeah, I'll get your thoughts about what I should do about this and we'll see you in the next video. It does occur to me though, I have no idea whether it saved that state or not. It probably didn't. <laughs> it probably, probably... I mean, it just says start game. I don't know if we're gonna continue from where I left off. Or, I mean, and that mission had a timer, so I don't know how that works either. So many questions. Anyway, we'll find out more next time. For now, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.